Hi, welcome back. Well, we are here with our next guest. We have CJ Palmer from the Oceanside Parks and Recreation Department, and he is here to talk to us about our Country Club Senior Center. Welcome to the show, CJ. Uh, thanks for having us. Uh, you know, it's so great because we have two new, two senior centers here in the city of Oceanside, and the one that I remember most because there been, there's been so many different activities here is the one that's here at the Country Club. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, there's quite a few things that are going on, and, and uh, so I know you're gonna tell us a little sure. bit about it and kind of how we're serving some of our seniors yeah. here in our city. Absolutely, Country Club is the original Regional okay. Senior Center. All right. And uh, El Corazon's the newer senior center. Yes. And uh, we're excited to just be in Oceanside, be part of Parks and Recreation. Oceanside's pretty lucky that we have two senior centers. Yeah. But there's a lot of seniors in the city there of Oceanside. Is. This is our, our community here with us being so close yeah. to the military base and, you know, a lot of large corporations. We have a lot of people who decide they're going to yeah. go ahead and retire. What a great place to yeah. retire, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the city's done a great job with uh, just making sure that seniors have something available for them mm -hmm. not only resources but also events oh. and it's nice to uh, have senior centers as part of parks and recreation i think when you normally think of parks and recreation you think of t-ball and little league right. and soccer and all that kind of stuff but with the huge population of seniors in oceanside um, we want to just offer so much more to that senior community. Right, right. And what are some of the things that, that you're offering to uh, the seniors here? In yeah, so obviously we have the two recreation centers. Okay. And on a daily basis we offer and we partner with places like Maricosta College. Oh. So we offer, through Maricosta College, uh, art classes, um, tai chi classes, exercise classes, yoga, chair yoga. And then also through our, our centers we offer ceramics, um, all kinds of different groups. We have a huge senior anglers fishing group. Oh, you know, that's about 200 wow. strong. Oh. So uh, we have knitting, crochet, the typical things that you think of probably when uh, a senior hits that magic senior age and yes. wants to slow down a little bit. Yeah. But we've noticed a lot of our seniors don't want to slow down. Oh, they don't. You know, okay. they, they want to they <laughs> come in and hit the ground running. And so we have sat back and we've said, how do we come up with some really great things mm -hmm. that even these baby boomers are going to be interested ah, in. So we just finished so up our come up yeah, with our first thing we just came up with. We just finished up our uh, senior sock hop dance. Ah. So we took them back to the 50s and 60s and just had a great night with root beer floats, oh, some beer tasting, yeah, um, oh. the old sock hop dance music, yeah. and had some great sponsorship for that. We uh, we have a holiday ball coming up on uh, December 10th. Oh, because who doesn't want to get dressed up? Yeah, they love it. <laughs> they love it. So we do that. We do that down at the Junior Sale Beach Amphitheater downtown. Oh, nice. Dancing's yeah. a big thing for seniors. It is. It yeah. is a big yeah. music, thing. There's music. Music is, yeah. is very very good. Yeah. 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 So we're just looking at those kind of events. I'd love to create an event where our seniors can come out and mingle one night in one of our great parks in Oceanside. Oh. Bring out yeah. all the taco trucks, yeah. throw a dance floor in the middle of the park, and okay. just let them get to know each other. Let yeah. them dance the night away. Yeah. Um, we have bingo, we have bridge. Mm. So we have a lot going on at our senior centers. So you really, so the thing is, of course, you want individuals to know what's going on yeah. at the at the at the senior center, so that yeah. those who are per, perhaps staying at home. What do we do then? So what yeah. if you have someone that's not able to drive themselves? Do you have transportation yeah. to help? Yeah. So through the Country Club Senior Center, we have three different entities within that center. Number one is our nutrition department. We serve lunch every single day, mm -hmm. 11, 15 to 12 o'clock. Okay. That's run through the county. We partner with them very well. Um, and then we have transportation to get them there. It's a okay. dollar for the round trip. Wow. So all the senior needs to do that's sitting here watching this is to give us a call at okay. that number all right. and uh, say, hey, I would love to come over and be part of your lunches. We'll get them there. And then we have a transportation program that's run through the city. It's called Solutions for Seniors on the Go. Mm. And this is for seniors that just need rides to doctors, dentist appointments, and they're starting to give rides to local errands as well. Oh, very good. So Perfect. all they need to do is give us a call and okay. we have a whole group of volunteers that will come that will pick them up for free okay. and they will get them to where they need to go. Perfect. Very good. Well, thank yeah. you so much for what you're doing for our yeah. seniors here in our you community. Bet. Yeah. Yes. Our go golden years. We want to help you <laughs> keep them golden. Make sure you contact the Senior Center right here at the Country Club.